And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. MLB The Show has interleague action for you this afternoon. It's the Boston Red Sox going up against the Cincinnati Reds. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Just about set to go. And on the hill, the big righty, Hunter Green. Well, just a three-pitch mix in his arsenal, which, you know, it's not a lot for a starter. So always very important for him to have a good feel and command all three. Sometimes you can make that three look like four if you add or subtract a little bit of velocity on one. But, you know, one thing about it, it can be easy to get too predictable out there on the mound. So hitters are aware of that. Mixing those three pitches at all counts is going to be a big key for him in this one. Line drive, base hit. So a man on base to start the inning. Went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel. This one's into the outfield. Could be extra bases. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. He was all over that one. Solid swing from start to end. On that time with everything. The really good base balance. Base. Nice first extension. Base. And he met it out front for the line drive knock. Now the go-ahead runs in scoring position, so big opportunity for them to jump ahead late. And the pitch. Swing and a miss. 99. How do you do? The only situation here, he's been working up in the zone. Typically, you look for guys to get that ground ball, see if he adjusts on this next pitch. Swing and a high fly ball. That one out towards left center field. Way back there. Gone. The Red Sox score first. It's 3-0. That's a fun way to take the lead. Just hit one out of the park. That's an impressive swing of the bat to go over the wall to the opposite field gap. And you know, there are a lot of guys that just don't have the pop to do that. And probably just as many who don't have the approach either. He let that ball travel and he got great extension on the follow through to drive it out of here. That's a base hit. With that fastball, even though it's high velocity, you've got to live on the outer edges. When it's right on a tee, right down the middle, professional hitters are not going to have a problem turning it around. Here's Trevor Story. That one ripped. Benson going back on this one. Slams into the wall and hangs on. That is good. The right fielder. Man at first, so stepping in from Boston, Willier Abreu. Green, a 6'5 righty, 240 pounds, a former first-round pick back in 2017. Line drive. Steer makes the grab. Two away. Here's Tyler O'Neill. The left fielder, Tyler O'Neill. Ripped on a line. Benson makes the catch. And that is that. Sox get three on the homer. It's now 3 nothing. Back here in Cincinnati, getting the nod on the mound, Nick Pavetta. He has a great ability to command a game boom, but in order for that to happen today, he's got to limit damage, make smart pitches, and avoid big innings. If he were a golfer, we'd say he needs to avoid any double bogeys out there, and if he does, his scorecard is going to look pretty good at the end of the day. And a swing and a miss there. 
They're off to a great start. Three run lead after their first inning, but so important to be airtight defensively. Don't give away extra outs and allow that other club to get back in this ballgame. Just blown away in that at bat. Three fastballs, all strikes. He wasn't even able to foul one off. There's not much you can take away from an at bat like that as a hitter, other than maybe there's something wrong with your eyes. Got to have better timing on the fastball next time. Pavetta. He has a reputation, I don't know, maybe a knack for working himself ah. out of tough situations no that he finds himself in. You know, you like that in a relief pitcher, but when you have it for a starting pitcher, a guy that can get out of a tight. Swing and a drive, deep right field. Way back there. Gone. He dunks it off the foul pole. He made him pay for that one, and they're on the scoreboard. It's 3-1. It looked like it had plenty of distance, but there was just no telling if it was going to stay fair. I mean, he really hooked that thing down the right field line. But good thing that big pole was there to let us know. Could have very easily just been a long strike if he hit it out front any more than he did. Spencer Steer, batting with one down, takes a strike. Swing, and that ball smashed on a line. O'Neill makes the grab for the second out. Here's David Bell's lineup for the Cincinnati Reds. Singy, we're looking at a really young lineup here, so not much experience, but it also means they're going to bring a lot of energy to the table most days. Well, we're in a golden age of young players. I mean, these players, they're getting up to the majors. They're dominating from a young age, bringing home plenty of hardware early in their careers. I mean, before they even get to free agency. So, you know, when you consider all of that, I love seeing the kind of energy that a team like this brings to the yard every day, day in and day out. Sends it to center, and that's going to do it. And he'll put it away. Ball game. And the Red Sox claim the win here behind some great pitching and defense. 3 1 ball game, quick game. We were looking for a little bit more. It seemed at points the offenses were going to break out, but a total of four runs combined. Really good pitching and defense on both sides. Just a couple of key swings making all the difference.